poetry. I mean, shit, everyone's seen positive poems lately. So this is the one positive poem I've written lately. Mm -hmm. And it's dirty. <laughs> <laughs> so if anything's going to bring the positive out, it's the good fuck. <laughs> <laughs> And Connor, I actually, it's your fault I'm drawing this. <laughs> you mentioned bed sheets and, right. and also small spoilers. And by way of my small spoiler, I will say the book that is mentioned in this poem, I promise I didn't borrow from any of you. I actually borrowed it from my nan. <laughs> this is called The Aftermath. <laughs> Last night, I dreamed quick, like a shallow bar. This morning, I've been filled in most of the possible ways, or will be. Rubbing love onto the covers of other people's books, <laughs> damp bedsheets. I am a used, spoiled, plump little cloud, curled, happy. I don't even smell like me. Intoxicating, oh, the combinations, the dirt under my fingernails the parts of him on me. Gone all vapour, floppy, I smiled to myself mildly. His cum invisibly soaked into my chest. Dirty sternum is not sorry, rolls around in a flurry. Untucked cotton makes an overcast sky, pure, consistent joy of me. I'll drift a little while. He's already clean, chosen late for work, easy, lifting steam from soon delivered tea. Thank you so much for having me. And if you ever realise that you've accidentally put one of your nan's books on your damp bed sheets with your sticky sex hands. The only thing you can do is write a poem about it. Mm. Good night. <laughs>